The boys are finally back in town. And by the boys, I mean you, me and Jacob. I'm always here. This bridge right here does not have any cars on it. It's literally for people to walk across. There's a bunch of benches and stuff up there. This is the best spot. It's actually so far the grossest spot. There's a very suspect sock on a rock over there. How many there. likes is it going to take for you to put that on? The sock yeah. on the rock? I don't want to know the last thing that that touched. On a real note, this place is pretty incredible. I found some crazy bad things here. A lot of people hang out on this bridge and they toss stuff in the water. You can find good things, but also the worst of the worst. We're looking for a mixture of both. You never know what you're going to find. Dude, how are you the biggest treasure hunter and you got holes in your gloves, brother? It's all the treasure I'm finding. Man. Oh. I just can't keep up and keep buying gloves. Like, they <laughs> told me there's a new shipment coming in. <laughs> I don't know if that's a diamond ring, no, brother. that's real. $25,000. It actually is a real ring. Oh, 14K on the inside. So that's real gold. Could be real. Oh, there's actually two diamonds. I thought that was missing. The big one's missing. <laughs> Give us our hype speech, dog. All right, listen. <laughs> that's something y'all don't do. Just get in your mind and listen. Today's the day, Brandon. We're going to be the greatest tre We already are the greatest treasure hunters. And we already are the greatest scuba dive. What more can we be? The greatest, no, we are, we are the greatest, yeah. Brandon, you know, I've neutered you since you were a kid. Neutered me? Ne neutered you. <laughs> what does that even mean? I, and I just knew you had a spark in your eye. And today, everything lines up your whole life to this moment in time. We're gonna make history. We're gonna find the greatest things ever underwater. I mean, I'm talking of the caliber of million dollars in a suitcase, diamond ring, I've already found a diamond ring. Uh, <laughs> Roll the f***ing <laughs> glare. Roll the f***ing glare. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're just going to do great, man. I'm going to crush you. I just knew it. I saw it in your eyes when you were two years old. To that today would be the day. <laughs> What's today? The day. No, but what is the date? You don't even know it's what the August day is. August 2nd. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've been planning my whole life for this moment. Obviously, I know. It is the day. <laughs> If you connect it here, it's infinite power. <laughs> <laughs> it says booty. No, it does not. Yeah. Oh, we got to play that. Booty talk. Oh. 64. Oh, we're taking that home. Let's put that in the bag. <laughs> Maybe booty, booty talk is a real popular booty thing. Talk. Maybe. It's like Lil Wayne's first album. We like just found it. <laughs> <laughs> the Holy Grail. <laughs> <laughs> Literally two. I just turned the corner. Yeah. You know what the best sound in the world is. <laughs> it is, dude. It is a good one. <laughs> my, my biggest fan. Dude, I didn't know our fans were even out here with us, bro. I know, it's a big one too. I'm it's like, like everywhere we go, we meet fans. I know, dude. This is incredible. <laughs> That honestly is just, man. wow. It's like we're bringing a fan today. Yeah, we're diving with a fan today. Yeah. <laughs> Let me get a picture of you with this fan. Hey. Today. This is crazy. Oh God, he's a little heavier than I expected. Wow, this is so nice, man. Take a picture of me with a fan. All right. All right, perfect. <laughs> nice, nice. Hey, it was nice to meet you. What's your name? This is- Lasko, it's Lasko. Lasko, nice Lasko. to meet you, bro. Hey, hey, hey nice hey, to meet hey. you, Lasko. <laughs> <laughs> It's an old radio. It still works. Look, I'll turn the music on. Oh, <laughs> oh that's nice, dude. Find one. Okay, go, go. <laughs> this is the best find of the day. What kind of gun is it? It's a pistol. 
Yeah, no, it really is, yeah. It's a Mega Launcher pistol. I mean, it's actually a Maverick Rev 6. That right there is a possible murder weapon if I've ever seen one. Oh, I mean, dude. Yeah. Gosh, Lee. Oh my gosh, man. It's nice. <laughs> Dude, how is it we always find toy guns? <laughs> I don't know. What kind of Look toy how gun? long it's been down there. Is I don't know, it does it? Oh, oh it is a nerf gun. No, it's no, a nerf no. gun. Wow. <laughs> Hi! Hi! Water is rising! Yeah. The, the vest. We, we got them on. I think people secretly hate us. <laughs> <laughs> Remember when I almost got arrested for wearing my life jacket? Yeah. Because I wasn't wearing my life jacket, but yeah. I was wearing it. Yeah. It was a long story. Uh, back to what I was saying before I almost died and then got yelled at for wearing my life jacket. Dude, I don't know. That's weird, bro. Dude, that's the, the Rock Trap 3000. You know, I don't understand what's going on here. <laughs> a brick yeah. zip tied to a trap with rocks in it. That is what it is. <laughs> it's a rock trap. It's a rock trap. He's collecting rocks. He picked a time. good spot yeah, to rock <laughs> There's plenty of rocks It's around. probably his personal best case. <laughs> yeah, honestly. <laughs> Most of you guys call me Jigging with Jordan. Some of you know me by my government name, which is Brandon Jordan. Other of you know me as Captain Submarine Captain Jordan. And now, because of established titles, I can also go by Lord. Brandon Jordan. Established Titles is a project based on a historic Scottish custom where landowners are referred to as lords or ladies in English. They allow people to buy as little as one square foot of dedicated land so they can call themselves a lord or a lady. They're committed to planting a tree with every order and it's a fun helpful way to preserve the picturesque woodlands and the biodiversity of Scotland while supporting the global afforestation effort. Title Facts give you at least one square foot of dedicated land on a private estate in Edelson, Scotland and an official certificate certificate with a crest. Your certificate features a unique plot number which you can see the exact location of your land. They plant a tree with every order and work with global charities, one tree planted, and trees for the future to support global reforestation efforts. It makes a great last minute gift for your loved ones. They even have couple packs that come with adjoining plots of land. You can officially change your name to Lord or Lady and get it on your credit card, plane tickets, etc. You can even get it on your dating profile. It makes an amazing last minute gift. Established Titles is currently running a massive sale right now plus you guys can use the code jiggin to get an additional 10 percent off all you got to do is go to establishedtitles.com slash jiggin to get your gift now and help support the channel Woo! That is old, and that's one of the coolest like that's backs awesome. ever. Holy crap! 
Wow, dude, the river is literally eating that over time. Yeah, that's a cool find right there. It's just the inside. It won't work because I have the battery. Oh, here. Right. Yeah. Just plug it in. There you go. No, I think it's okay. fine. Hello? Hello. Is it oh, Susan? It's, Let me guess. It is Susan, Susan. again. There's a bike right there. Bike. There's like four bikes out here. <laughs> Dude, you can hear those rapids so loud. All that sand. It's so scary. I'm like, oh. Because <laughs> you don't really know how yeah, close I mean, you, you are. you down that. Yeah, you're screwed. Not good. No coming back. <laughs> Is someone so, peeing someone, off the bridge? Yeah, someone's right? peeing off the bridge. Someone's definitely pissing off the Where's that? Where is that coming from, ice? I hear it. <laughs> I don't see it, though. This is scary. Alright guys, you, this is the bridge, brother. <laughs> this is the bridge, brother. <laughs> This is actually my very first Xbox. <laughs> I never owned an Xbox, so now I got one. That's hilarious. You found an Xbox 360 yeah. in the river. Yeah, this is my <laughs> very first Xbox right here, that's technically. That's your first one? Yeah. Man, that's a shame. I think it has the red ring of death. <laughs> <laughs> the red ring of death. Let me see. Let's turn it on. Here, push the button real quick. Okay, there you go. Yeah, yeah, sure enough, it is the red ring of death. That is the cause of why it's not going to work anymore. You know, huh. that's probably the only reason it wouldn't work. The only reason. Other than that, it's fully operational. Yeah. Obviously, we are out of the water. Jake, don't be looking at all I'm my fine, fine, I'm sorry. Little did you guys know, it actually took like two and a half days to make this video. <laughs> it was hard, man. The water freaking went up, and then one day it was raining. So you guys could probably tell like in the GoPro clips versus the last time we were holding this camera, it's just completely different. We're not even in our scuba gear right now. We went home, took a shower, got cleaned up. It's been a long day, but we found some really good stuff and now we get to show you guys. There's a lot of stuff that you guys haven't even seen of Jake's that's pretty freaking fire. Shoot, you got the best find, I think. The rock trap. The, the rock, rock trap. trap. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna start off with my favorite find, and that's this 14 karat real diamond ring. I thought that was really incredible. I actually found this without even scuba diving. Brandon was so jealous. <laughs> that was your first find of the day. I think so, yeah. And he actually diamond tested it, and it is real. And uh, probably the most valuable find of the day. Most valuable find of the day is Booty Talk 64. This has so much information that everyone needs, so I thought that was kind of cool. <laughs> A fidget spinner. A knife, you know, a potential murder weapon, some bullets, some more diamonds. These aren't real, but a bunch of phones. My favorite Dude, phone. Dude, that is one this is one. wild, Look at that. bro. That's been down there for so long, and the camera's even holding on still. I yeah. thought that was pretty cool. That's crazy. I will say, bro, one of the funnier finds that's, that's underrated are these glasses, yeah. and they're taped all the way around. Now, I will say, even though that iPhone's pretty cool, this flip phone is my favorite, and there's a reason. Check it out. Not because it flips but because they put a pop socket on the back. <laughs> and I was like, why would they put a pop socket on the back? And I got hanging out, I was like, hey, this is actually kind of cool. <laughs> Dude, Hold on, I'm getting a call You honestly look so hey. smooth, too. Hello? Okay. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Man, we put these bad boys on, and then you can listen to Sheesh. anything you want. Right now, I'm listening to Booty Talk. 64, 64 reasons why to listen to it. 64 hours, 64 days. 64,000 minutes. 24, saved. 64. This is pretty sick. Too. That's amazing. Either way, Jake said we were gonna find guns under the bridge, and he was right, but they were Nerf guns, so it is not as good. You gotta be careful what, this is one of those things where they say you gotta be careful what you wish for, Jacob. Oh yeah? You wish for a gun, and you got one, but it's not <laughs> it's the like gun you thought. It's like a genie giving us like what we want, but no, it's not exactly it's the river gods. Oh, oh yeah, the river gods. The river gods. Yeah. Uh, it's dripping on me, I'm putting that no. down. Now, 
we did have uh, this bullet that was found right here, mm -hmm. which is pretty cool. Now this is a real one and Jake found some bullets and we also had a bullet we couldn't get up. Unfortunately, we didn't find the gun. I'm pretty sure it is there. We got ants everywhere. Those are complimentary ants. I didn't find those, but we got a phone here. We got two phone batteries. We've got the top of a phone. We've got some more batteries, golf ball tools, rock trap, and one of the coolest finds is the Xbox that I found right here. Now, this thing is actually pretty sick. So you got this side, you got this side, which I can't oh tell which God. is my favorite. This one's like dirty, dirty. <laughs> and then you've got the front, yep. which is pretty cool. First Xbox 360. No, first Xbox ever. I've never oh, had wow, really? You never, had, had you never had an Xbox? Never had an Xbox. Did you have a PlayStation? I had a PlayStation 3. How was that? Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, so I moved on up. So I'm gonna go <laughs> so home. I moved on. Plug, up. <laughs> plug this thing in. I don't know. I I was thinking about someone got like rage quit. Like it's yeah. funny to think about that. But I was thinking like a spiteful ex-girlfriend's like yeah. a real funny one. Then he also brought up like the red ring of death. Maybe yeah, it had yeah. the red ring and you just pissed off and chucked. But it the here's the problem. Yeah. You're at your house. Mm -hmm. You have some type of problem. Yeah. You take the Xbox. Put it in a backpack. Put the backpack in your car. Drive your car to the bridge. You can't drive on the bridge because it's a pedestrian bridge. It's hot. Then you take the backpack onto your back, walk across the pedestrian bridge, take the Xbox out of the backpack, toss it into the river, and then boom, Brandon J finds it. And Booty Booty Talk 64 <laughs> fell out of the Xbox 360. Oh, what, what if Booty Talk goes to the Xbox? It could. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think that is going to wrap it up for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a fun one. Uh, Jacobson, um, we gotta find the real guns under the bridge, not just I like know. the nerf I, ones. I, I, it's a I hot know. spot. There are guns there. They're there. We found bullets, dude. Yeah. We found Wait, bullets. You know, I was hanging out with the world's best treasure hunter and I thought we would find it. You kept saying it, so yeah. I mean, hey. <laughs> you know what my favorite thing of all of today was, besides like huh. the rock trap? When we found the fan. It was like, I'm hanging out with the fans. <laughs> that was a big fan. Hanging out with the man. fans underwater. I mean we took him diving we, and then we, we left him there. I don't know where it happened. Yeah, he drowned. He, he's He's still hanging out over there. It's always fun to dive with you. Unfortunately, Tristan is not here. No, nope, no. But that's why we probably found all that cool we, stuff. We need to call him and tell him we did find a gun. We don't need to tell him it's a Nerf gun. The, yeah, the thing know. is, when all three of us dive together, we just have a good time. Mm -hmm. But when two of us dive together and one of the three is not there, somebody finds a banger. So it that's just It doesn't matter who's not there. Right. It's just it could be me and Tristan <laughs> And Jake's not there, and we'll and find, they find something yeah. amazing. I'm yeah. like, no! It's just kind of a running joke, so we gotta call T and give him a hard time. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm gonna be back in Georgia more often with the boys. I just, you know, I'm living my life down in Florida and I'm gonna start coming up a little more. So this old school content, if that's what you subscribe for in the beginning, it's gonna be more of what you're gonna see. So hope you uh, enjoyed, I probably already said that, but I guess I really hope you enjoyed. <laughs> all right, I love you all. I'll see you on the next one, peace out.